What's up guys, this is Paco Minel back with a very special video review. Today we are going to take a look at the factory calibrated AOC PDS241 24 inch monitor designed by Studio FA Porsche. The Porsche brand is synonymous with performance but also with a certain flavor of functional, reliable, no-nonsense design. Latest to benefit from the particular Studio FA Porsche treatment is AOC with a new range of screens. This month, AOC will release two monitors aimed at the aspiring designers and content creators. AOC PDS241 and its 27-inch version, the AOC PDS271, both feature the same specs including full HD resolution, IPS panel, and the same stylish and minimalist design, with the external power box which houses the HD my input. This PDS241 model will be sold for around $245. Here are its full specifications. 23.8 inches screen, 1920 by 1080 resolution, 16 by 9 aspect ratio, IPS panel, 60 Hz, 4MS grade to grade response time, 1 HDMI 1.4 port, 1 headphone output with a brightness of 250 CD, static contrast of 1000 to 1, dynamic contrast of 50 million to 1, and a pixel pitch of 0.27 millimeters. Taking a look at what comes in the package apart from the power cable and the power brick, there's a short mini HDMI cable. No full-sized HDMI cable is included. This won't be a problem as I'm sure you have an HDMI cable laying around anyway. The PDS241 looks beautiful. The stand is very minimalist, the bezels are almost non-existent, and the panel is super thin. It's advertised to be thinner than a typical smartphone. The unique sleek looking stand is a big part of why this display looks so good. The brushed metal and attention to detail really makes it look classy. Taking a closer look at the stand, you'll notice that all cabling is integrated into the stand itself. The HDMI cable goes into the external power brick and a mini HDMI cable supplies both power and video signal to the monitor via input port at the end of the stand base. This cabling solution eliminates desktop clutter and makes for an overall aesthetically pleasing look. This 23.8 inch model is recommended for color critical work due to higher pixel density compared to the 27 inch model. I'm sure it also costs considerably less than its big brother, the PDS271. This model has a rich pixel density of 90 2 pixels per inch which manifests in a more detailed image quality preferred by professional designers. The AOC PDS241 PC monitor features LG's AH IPS panel for the superb 178 degree viewing angles and accurate color reproduction. 8-bit color def is also supported with dithering but the monitor will also cover 100% of the sRGB color gamut which equals 90% NTSC and a very high 87% of Adobe RGB. This makes the monitor adequate for professional photography among other things such as office work, video streaming, and casual gaming. AOC dubs this as the super color wide color gamut due to the superb color accuracy and consistency. Other notable features include the AOC low blue light filter which eliminates the harmful blue lights and allows you to enjoy reading an ebook before bed for example without feeling eye fatigue. In addition to the flicker free screen, you'll be able to watch the AOC PDS241 screen for hours without straining your eyes. The fact that this monitor only supports 60Hz without adaptive sync means that this is definitely not a gaming monitor. However, the PDS241 offers a quick 4 millisecond response time speed, which means you'll still be able to play all your games without too much blur or ghosting in fast-paced scenes. However, if you're looking for a monitor specifically for gaming, I would recommend you look at other options with adaptive sync faster response time, and a higher refresh rate. The monitor is not aimed at gamers. While this is a very capable monitor for office work and color critical applications, it does have its downsides and limitations however. The striking design comes at a cost of limited ergonomic support as there is no VESA mount compatibility, and the monitor is tilted only by 3.5 degrees forward and 21.5 degrees backward. There is also no height adjust on this monitor. The monitor also has the most simplistic OSD I've ever seen on any monitor. The one button menu system only allows you to adjust the brightness and contrast, overdrive volume, and language settings. There are no color calibration options available which is very surprising and alarming to see. Thankfully, the screen looks amazing out of the box anyway, so it's easy to overlook the fact that you can't get down to the nitty gritty of personally calibrating your screen using the OSD. So what's the bottom line? If you're an aspiring content creator or office worker looking for a truly unique, sleek looking premium monitor that doesn't break the bank, the AOC PDS241 is a good choice. This monitor is undeniably beautiful and it features stunning color accuracy. However, if you're a gamer, I would definitely suggest you look at other monitors that are intended for gaming use. There you have it guys, my quick video preview of the AOC PDS241 monitor designed by Studio FA Porsche. Like, comment, subscribe if you found this video to be informative. As always, I'm your host, Paco Minel, and I'll catch you in a future video.